What's happening? What's cracking? We got to get into this reaction. This is your boy Who is Q, aka Who is Quincy. Go like, comment, subscribe. It only takes you five or ten seconds. Really, do that. Do that. Go right here. Hit the red subscribe button. Hit the notification bell as well. Do that. Do that. Do that. Let them haters hate and let them talk and let them just do whatever they gotta do. But go right here. And scroll on to the Instagram page, follow, like, comment, do all those great things. Like, it really don't take you long at all. You're going to watch the videos. Them Y'all haters going to watch them too. So, haters, continue watching. And watch the success of a real G. Get there. Do it. Do it. But we about to uh, watch this video of Joe Rogan speaking on PMB, Rock, uh, Murder, Recipes PMB Rock, but we're gonna get into the video and see what Joe Rogan and his other guy was talking about. I don't know who was in the video with him, and no disrespect. I I just I just this is my first time seeing it, so we about to get into this video. So let's get into the video. Let's go. Why are you wasting time? Wasting time. Wasting time. Let's go. R.P. to PNB Rock. I don't know if you know who that is. He just died last week. He got murdered in uh, L.A. at Roscoe's. Wearing a chain. They came in to rob him. You know, it's a lot of rappers and people getting robbed in L.A. for jewelry. He seemed like he a uh, boxer because they look like a boxing, boxing glove. So he obviously seemed like a boxer. Apparently his girlfriend, I don't want to put it on her, but she posted their location on Instagram. 20 minutes later, somebody came into that Roscoe's in Inglewood and um, killed him right there uh, trying to get his jewelry. And this is the thing that I was thinking about. Like as a black man in America being myself, imagine I worked my ass off to get out of the, the inner city. The hood, the ghetto, whatever you want to say. Say I, I, I amass some wealth, some success. I can buy a nice car. I can get some jewelry, a nice watch. Imagine waking up every day knowing, like, if I put this on, I might lose my life because somebody that looks like me want to take it. Justin. And, and the, the messed up thing about it is, yeah, people might want to take it. And a lot of times, these people are taking fake jury. They're taking fake jury. Or uh, not even what is, what is, uh, Whatever that word is, I can't even think right now. But they seen him taking this jury that it's a praise at this level and it's not even nowhere near it. It might be a praise that uh, they saying four hundred thousand dollars, four hundred thousand dollars in jury, but it's ten thousand dollars. And now you going robbing this person, taking it, shot him, and you going to uh, go get some money for it, they ain't going to give you nothing but $1,000 for it because that's what it's worth. Sad. You didn't risk your life on some bullshit. Bieber don't got to worry about that. Uh, Enrique Iglesias ain't got to wor worry about that. Jake Paul don't got to worry about that. But like, if they go to the wrong place in L.A., they do have to worry about but that But that's now. the stigma that's, that's the counter. Yeah, that's I heard Charlemagne the God talking about it today. That's the counter. Anybody goes into those neighborhoods with that on. A mailman, if he had a jury, some jury on, you definitely you're going to get robbed. It ain't just a rapper thing. Some guy got shot recently uh, in front of a Beverly Hills uh, restaurant. Same reason. Yeah, he got killed. But and, and I think he was trying to intervene, right? I don't know. I think I know. It's happening a lot. In L.A., it's bad. You know, like one of my best friends that I grew up with, his name is Mr. Organic, he's an influencer. And he's one of those guys, yeah. Flash. I know Mr. Organic, well, I don't know him. Lamborghini but truck, Mr. And, I, Organic. and it's my best friend I grew up with. I haven't seen and him. I had a talk with him the other day where I was like, bro, like you're known now, you've built your brand to the point where people know you. I'm, I'm worried about you. I told him, yeah, Yo, you got to get out of L.A. Like, I told him that I, I, I feel comfortable as a man Waking up that I told my best friend, that, bro, I need you to leave L.A. Is he interested? Yeah. Yes and no. Because think about it. You have masked your success there. Right. People know you. Like, you don't want where you want to go. He was in Minnesota. I that. Minnesota. But it's like, bro, people make YouTube. Anytime he posts a video on his channel, 
it's a million YouTubers countering the video, talking shit, trolling them. Like, so people know his life. They putting his address out there. Like, his, he, 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 you know, he got a new house. They like, we found that. If they sitting here finding what you stay at, you got to move, bro. You got to keep that. Hush, hush. You can't just let everybody know where you rest your head at, where your kids at, all this type of stuff. Especially that, because a lot of the stuff what these people are talking about that's online, it's a lot of negative people that sit here and talk about it. But you might get way more support of love than negative comments. But these negative comments, you got to pay attention to these people. Uh, there's a lot of people that's hating. There's a lot of people that's hating that want your position. So you got to watch that. You got to watch that. You got to watch that. <laughs> house. I'm thinking like, bro, you got to get the fuck up out it's of here. It's a matter of time. Honestly, yeah. knock on wood. Yeah. But it's like, I mean, you can't really roll around L.A. in a Rolls Royce dime wrapped and things like that. And, and, and honestly, bro, I love my friend, bro, and I, and I want him to leave L.A. And it's scary when you, and the day before PNB Rock got killed, I had that conversation with him. The, very next day, PNB got rock. Like PNB rock got killed for his jury. You had that conversation with your friend. Yes. God. LA is. I left. No more California for me. Where you at now? Vegas. I'm in Vegas. Yeah, I'm fucked. Cali. Yeah. Oh wow. I mean, I hear a lot of people that say here that's from California moved in Vegas a lot. A lot of artists. A lot of just people that's. It's game bangers or whatever the case may be. I hear a lot of that 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 people that was in uh California moving to Vegas. I don't know if it's a lot of just none of that stuff and it's out of touch with a lot of people that can't get there and get to the enemigos and none of that type of stuff. But you you gotta do what you gotta do. For real. You gotta do what you gotta do. But hey, can you blame him? You can't blame him at all. Crazy, right? Yeah, Isn't that a wild I'm thing to say? Doing, Would yeah. you imagine saying that 10 years ago? I know. I remember you told me years ago to leave. And that was just the politics. <laughs> yeah. But now yeah. it's... It's dangerous. Like, you know, I don't drive a Rolls Royce or I got a Range Rover. And that's nice enough. That's, that's nice enough to get robbed. And I'm like, yo, I don't even... Like, what the fuck? What's the... But, I mean, I get him. He, he's speaking... He's speaking some real stuff. And he's, I mean, he's speaking real. I mean, now I don't stay out there. And I don't know the politics that's out there because the politics down here is way different than out there. But, uh, shit. You got to pay attention to what your surround, surroundings is. They tell you not to do that. Don't do that. Uh, they they say him say put this on, put this on. Do not move this way because people are just paying attention to watches, earrings, jewelry, all those type of things. They don't care if it's fake or whatever. They are gonna take it because they think it's real. So, and a lot of these rappers wear fake jewelry, and y'all are losing your life over fucking. A thousand dollars worth of jewelry, and that's unfortunate. And it's unfortunately that y'all sitting out here robbing and taking jewelry that don't cost as much as what you're thinking. So second guess, uh, second guess, all that shit. Don't even take no jewelry from these people. Just sit here and try to get it yourself. Get it yourself. What's wrong with hustling? We all came from the struggle. We all came from the hustle. Just do it. Do it. But hey, my hustle is this right now. And like, comment, subscribe to who is Quincy, aka who is Q. Playlist right here. Videos right here. Subscribe right here to another video. We gotta go. I like